WON YouTube Networks is now on Facebook. Check it out. Point twenty one and all record so far this year in the postseason. We look to try to prevent his M's from going down in the World Series. They are down three games to one. The defense for the M's looks like this. You have Cruz, Griffey Jr., Griffey Sr., Segarra, Cano, Martinez, Seeger, and catching the balls and strikes, Jorge Posada. Here's the wizard, switch hitter Ozzie Smith batting on the left side here tonight. As the Expos look to try to do damage and capture their first ever world title in baseball. Hershizer against Smith. First pitch of the ball game. Line to right field, but right at the first baseman for out number one. One pitch, one out. And I'll bring up Adam Eaton. Three for six in the postseason. 571 average, one home run, a couple of runs batted in. Hit a home run in a pitch hitting roll. Batting in the number two slot here tonight. Hit hard in the air to center field. Ken Griffey Jr. is there for out number two. Two quick outs on two pitches. Second baseman, Daniel Murphy. Coming up, Daniel Murphy. Murphy in here, four three in the postseason with seven home runs and 20 RBIs. Has two home runs here in the World Series. The Red Hot Andre Dawson batting in the number four spot is on deck if this inning continues. The two out delivery by Oral is foul away, strike one. Hard to believe this could be the final game of the 2018 baseball season. The 0-1. Foul the way, we'll do it again. The 0-2 on the way to Murphy, fly ball, well hand to right center, this could be caught. It will be by Griffey Jr. on the warning track, side retired. No hits, no runs, we played a half inning, the M's are coming to bat, no score. Far dive for them, you have Segura Griffey Sr. Martinez Griffey Jr., Edmonds, Cruz, Cano, Seeger, and Posada. On the mound for the Expos is Steven Strasburg, 1-0 in the postseason. An ERF 4.14. This is his third postseason start. He's been in two. The defense for the Expos here tonight in this game number five of the fall class. It looks like this. In the outfield, you have... Harper, Eaton, and Dawson. The infield, Smith, Murphy, Zimmerman, and Brett. And catching the balls and strikes, Gary Carter. So the battle will be Gene Segar, who has been absolutely dead at the plate. Everson's being hit a couple of times in game number one. That has set the table for him to be off balance. He takes the strike, 0-1, to begin the first inning. Segar against Strasburg, 3-for-8. Lifetime. 
Struck out once against Strasburg. The 0-1. Fouled away on two. Two masterful pitching performances. One by Don Sutton and then last night. Max Scherzer as Segura goes down swinging for the first strikeout of the ball game. Belonging to Strasburg does one down here in the first. Good morning. Good afternoon and good night. Three pitches equals a strikeout. So Segura's struggles continue and here's Ken Griffey Sr. Two for ten in this World Series. Average at 200 with one home run and two runs batted in. There's a strike on the four-seamer on one. Next year on WN, bring you more New York White Sox baseball along with selected Metropolis Expos baseball games. Looking forward to it in 2019. Line, base hit in the left. And Griffey Sr. is on base. First hit of the ball game, belonging to the M. Having of Edgar Martinez, the Hall of Famer to DH, but he's been struggling in this contest. 176 average in the World Series. Not that many hits so far in this series. There's a ground ball, could be two. There's one right, it's flipped by the Wizard to turn two. What a way to get out of it. Side retired. End of one, scoreless. Andre Dawson, a batter, hitting at 500 with four home runs and eight runs batted in in this World Series. Batting in the cleanup spot, Bryce Hopper dropped down to number eight. The struggles were real. As Andre lines one in a gap in left field, that's going to be a base hit and extra bases for Dawson. Scooting all the way to second with a leadoff stand-up double to begin the second inning. How about that? And now bring up George Brett to the plate. Brett betting on the left side. Could be his final game of his baseball career. He's hinted it. But we shall see. RBI chance here for George. He lines one deep to right field. Cruz on his horse is gone. So long farewell, George Brett. Puts the Expos on top, 2-0, with a two-run bullet home run. There's your crowd silent sir, for the third night in a row. A two-run homer. That ball was ripped to right field. Nothing that Nelson could do. He ran, but didn't run far enough. A two-run shot, and it's a 2-0 Metropolis Expos lead. The former White Sox on the verge of capturing another championship, but with another team. Comes up with a big two-run home run. Now here's Guerrero, who hits one high in the air to deep right field, and that one will go. So long, farewell, back to back all the Expos, and they now lead it three to nothing. Guerrero, who hit it to the Knicks County last night, continues his hot hitting. And it comes up with another big home run. It's three to nothing, Expos. Wow. So the Expos are not fooling around. They're taking full advantage offensively. And Guerrero just absolutely torched that ball. And it's a three to nothing, Expos lead. So in a game where they could capture their very first world title, they're not wasting any time. Here's Ryan Zimmerman. He chops one on the ground to the second base of Cano, who throws the first in time for the first out of the second inning. Now bring up the struggling Bryce Harper. A wake-up call for him to be batting in a number eight spot. He has struggled mightily in this World Series, and that is no exaggeration. Only two home runs in this series, not many hits at all. This could be his third home run of the series and it will be a long home run for Bryce Harper. So long, farewell, it's four to nothing, Expos. 
A wake-up call indeed, and on the first pitch, he tomahawks it deep into the night of suburbia metropolis. A solo home run for Harper, his third of the series, and it's a 4 to nothing Expos lead. That is their third home run in this inning alone. And the question now is going to be, how long will the Mariners keep Hershiser in the game knowing the circumstances? You're down 4 to nothing in a ball game, you must win, or the Expos will win the World Series. Mind you, heading into this contest, the Expos lead the series three games to one, with a win tonight, they'll win their first ever World Series championship. So everything's on the line, and here is Gary Carter. Carter with two big two-run home runs last night, was preserved and turned it out to be a game winner for the Expos. Four to nothing, Metropolis here in the top of the second. Hershiser set at the belt here, delivers the pitch and is lined to third, but right there is Kyle for route number two. Now well, bring up the top of the order, Ozzy Smith, who lined out his last time up back in the first inning. The two-out delivery, high fastball, two-seamer, strike one. The 0-1 delivery, ripped down the right field line, but foul will do it again, 0-2. O2 delivery, he rips it to right field, carrying is Nelson, but he makes the catch side retire, but the damage has been done. Three home runs, a total of four runs, middle of the second, Expos lead, 4-0. Well, Ken Griffey Jr. will be the batter, 4 for 16, an average of 250. Couple of home runs, couple of runs batted in. He, they're going to need his bat to wake up. And at a moment too soon, down four to nothing and three games to one in this World Series. He takes a strike instead, 0-1. Oh the 0-1. Oh Popped him up in the shallow left. Coming on is Dawson. He's under this one, makes the catch for the first out of the second inning. Batting designated hitter, Jim Edwards. Jim Evans, three for 16 tonight. Actually, this series, 187, two home runs, and two runs batted in. Evans need a wake-up call offensively. Ground ball to the Wizard at short. Edmonds is out. Two outs in the second. Batting fifth. Right fielder, hmm. Nelson Cruz. Let me finish this anyway. Nelson Cruz now at the plate. Two outs, nobody on. Takes a strike, on one. Cruz has struggled. There's no question about it. He does have one home run, but like the entire office of the M's, they just can't get anything going. Swing and a miss, so and two. With two outs and the bases empty. Strasburg ahead of Cruz, and another foul ball will do it again. The 0 2 on the way. Chopper toward the mound. Strasburg will take care of it, side retire. No hits, no runs. He played two, 4 to nothing Expos. Two. 
Two and on on uh, Adam Eaton as he began the third inning. And he lines one into center. That's going to be a base hit. Lead off single for Adam Eaton and the Expos have Sutton cooking again. Up next for the Nationals, second baseman, Daniel Murphy. Daniel Murphy now be the batter. He flew out his last time up to right center field. Lines it, but foul. Strike one. Takes a strike, going two. Nothing in two on Daniel. The pitch on the way. Hammers it foul. The 0-2 to Murphy. Strike out swinging. Here's your first out of the inning. Thank you, Ma. Andre Dawson. Oh, the battle will be Andre Dawson with a man at first, one out. The infield is in, the outfield is deep. High fly ball, well hit in the right center. Griffey Jr. going back on the warning track. He'll make the catch for the second out of the inning. George Brighton out of the batter with a big two-run home run back in the second inning. The two-out delivery. Lines one down the right field line, but foul. Whoa, he missed it. The 0-1 delivery. Chopper foul, 0-2. Expos lead four to nothing. The 0-2 delivery. Rice chops to the first. Inning over. One hit of is stranded. We play two and a half. It's four to nothing Expos in game five of the 2018 World Series. Leading off for the Mariners. Second baseman. Robinson, we go to the bottom of the third inning. Four to nothing Expos here. And Robinson Cano will lead off taking a curveball in there for a strike. The 0 1 delivery to Cano. Red tie and deep to right field. There it goes. So long. Farewell. What a shot by Robinson Cano. Don't you know? And no doubt about it, home run by Robinson is 4 to 1 Expo. No doubt about that one, and Strasburg, no, he made a mistake. And we have ourselves a ball game now. A three-run deficit for the Mariners. By the way, strike one by Seeger. 375, five home runs, seven runs batted in the postseason. Four to one, Expos lead. By the way, strike two. The 0-2, got him on a curveball that just made him look like a fool. There's one down. 
Yes, the pitch way out in front on that one. Another K of the day for Strasburg, and the batter will now be Jorge Posada. Seven for 15 in this World Series. Expos four, Mariners one. Foul away, strike one. The 0 1 delivery. Popped him up in the left field. Andre Dawson under this one makes the catch for out number two. The batter number two. The struggling Gene Cigar takes the strike, 0 and 1. The 0 1 underway. Ripped on the ground to third. Brett's got it. And this inning's over. Now, out before Robinson Cano hits a bomb into the streets of suburbia metropolis. At the end of three, in game number five of the World Series, it's the Expos four and the M's one. Leading off for Washington, designated hitter, Vladimir Guerrero. We go to the top of the fourth, and Vladimir Guerrero, who had a shot to right field, leads off here and chops one right back up the middle. The ship was on. Easy play for Cano. One pitch, one out. Now batting, the first baseman, Ryan Zimmerman. Here's Ryan Zimmerman. The one out delivery. Line but foul. That's going to be a souvenir for a fan. Nothing in one with a long time expo. What's hinted he may retire after this season. Zero. He looked like a fool on that one on two. No ball, two strikes. The pitch by Hershiser. We'll do it again. Foul ball. On the ground, base hit in the right center. So Zimmerman is on with a base hit. The right fielder, number 34, Bryce Harper. Well, Zimmer, well, Harper's at the plate. And on the first pitch he saw, his last half back, he tomahawked it out of here. He may have done it again. High fly ball, deep in the right field. Back is Griffey Jr. looking up at the wall. It's gone. He has indeed done it again. So long farewell. Bryce Harper with a two-run homer. His second of this game. His fourth of the World Series. It's 6-1 to one Expos. And I believe he's getting hot, folks. Carter now the batter takes it down low, one and zero. The one zero delivery, hit high in the air to center. Griffey Jr. going back makes the running catch, and there are two away in the fourth. The batter, number one, Ozzie Smith. The Wizard swings and misses on one.
On the ground to second. Cano's got it. Side retired, but not before Bryce Harper. It's a two-run shot. Into the seats and right. He's woke out of it, um, uh, obviously, unfortunately for the M. Expo six, M's one. Leading off for the Mariners. Left fielder, Ken Murphy. Griffey, Griffey Sr. fouls it back to begin the bottom of the fourth inning. Makes another strike. Oh, and two. The pitch. Out away, we'll do it again. The 0-2, got him. Another K for Strasburg, one down. Now batting, first baseman, Edgar Martinez. Edgar Martinez will now be the batter. One out, nobody on. Up the middle, there's a base hand to center. So Edgar's down with a one out hit here in the fourth. Ken Griffey Jr. Ken Griffey Jr. will now be the batter. One on, one out. Takes a strike, 0-1. Expo 6, M's 1, the Battle of Metropolis, but the battle for the World Championship of Baseball on the line. Popped them up. Foul ground from one kid to another. Carter makes the catch. <coughs> and there are two down in the fourth. As the Expos have a five run lead and can smell their first title, but they gotta get through this lineup. Jim Edmonds, the batter. Swings and pops it up in the left field. Coming on is Dawson. He's under this one. He's got it. Makes the catch, side retire. One hit, Amanda Stratton. We play four in game five of the World Series from Sportsman Park. It's the Expo six and the M's one. Well, Adam Eaton, the number two hitter, is stepping in to lead off here in the fifth inning. He's one for two tonight with a single a couple innings ago. Hersheiser back to work. There's another. Line drive, base hit in the left center. This could be more than two for Eaton. He's got the wheels. He's going in for two only. You cannot take a chance with Griffey Jr.'s arm, and Eaton was safe to go to second base only. Now we have Daniel Murphy. Daniel 0 for 2 tonight. Mike Leake is in the Mariners' bullpen just in case. Base hit in the right. Eaton will go to third and will stay put. Cruz with a heck of an arm. Keeps the runners honest. Runners at the corners. Nobody out. We're keeping an eye on the managerial uh, dugout to see if the manager will come out to take out all. And the answer is yes. We're going to keep it here. To see who will be coming in, most likely Mike Leake would, will, but another bad outing for a Mariners starting pitcher against his Metropolis 
Expos lineup. Your attention, please. Mike Leak is the bat is the pitcher. He'll have a lot of work to do and try to keep the Expos off bay. We're in the fifth inning, the top of the fifth. Two runners on at the corners for Dawson. Six to one, Expos Lee. That's too high, ball one on the cutter. The pitching staff in the bullpen of the Mariners has been taxed. A team which shocked the world by sweeping the best team in baseball in the American League, the New York White Sox, find themselves getting bombarded by the Expos. That's another foul ball, strike one. An Expos team which you knew was going to do damage, you knew was going to be strong, knew was going to be a World Series contender, but boy, have they really turned on the Jets in the postseason, especially in this World Series after the game one loss. Chopper, base hand to left. In comes Eaton to score. It's 7-1 Expos. RBI single for Dawson. It's first and second. Nobody out as the merry-go-round continues to round. Brings up George Brett, the star in this one, with the big two-road home run, which started the scoring, and the Expos have not looked back ever since. Tony Zach at the on the bullpen right now for the M. First and second occupied, nobody out. Swing and a miss, strike one. Red one for two with that two-run home run back in the second inning. One and one. Tony Zach, the only man in the bullpen for the Metropolis Mariners right now. Hoping Mike Lee can get out of this inning big time. Two on, nobody out. The pitch. Fouled away, one and two on Brett. One, two delivery. Hit hard to right field. Way back is Nelson and Griffey. It's gone. He's done it again. So long, farewell. George Brett hammers a three run over. A line drive bullet just over the fence. It silences this crowd and may have just put the champagne off ice. It's 10 to 1, Expos Lee. Holy cow, what a day for George Brett, the former New York White Sox who took a risky chance during the offseason to move on from the White Sox after an injury-prone season last season, signed with the Metropolis Expos, and well, look what he has done, not only this season, but in this World Series. Guerrero hammers it the other way to right field. That ball will go! Back to back go Guerrero and Brett for the second time in this game, and it's now 11-1 Expos. Wow. I'm on the air. Harry Finney. Ten run lead for the Expos and Ryan Zimmerman. Now, batting. now the batter. Ryan Zimmerman. A chopper. Leak to Martinez. It is a sarcastic cheer by the fans. For our number one. Right fielder. Oh, Hershiser cannot be happy for what has happened. And the Mariners, I think, understand the situation. There's not much time left to come back. Here's Bryce Hopper, who's gone deep twice here tonight. He just missed his third one with that one. Fouled away. He knows it, too. Strike one. Took a cutter outside and pulled it to right. Another chopper foul, 0-2. Batting in the number eight hole tonight after his struggles in the cleanup spot throughout this series. He hits one on the ground to the second base for Cano. He's got it, and there's your second out of the inning. 
Here's Gary Carter, 0 for 2 with a line out back in the fourth. And George Brett, three run home run may have just sealed the deal in this contest and in this series. Swing and a miss, strike one. The 0 1. Reach for that one, not close, 0 and 2. The 0-2 delivery to Carter, lined a deep left field. That ball is carrying a long way. It is off the wall. Carter scoots in a second. He's got himself a two-out double, and the onslaught continues for the Expos. The batter, number one. Now bring up Ozzie Smith, a.k.a. the Wizard. Switch hitter batting left-handed here today. Mike Leak and the pitching and the bullpen of the ends getting torched here in the fifth inning. Base hit to right. Carter will stay at third. Ozzie moves to first. Two out, two on here in the fifth. And now bring up Adam Eaton. Two out delivery, accidental hit in the right field for Adam Eaton. One run will score, it's 12 to one. Holy cow, can you believe that? Everything going right for the Metropolis Expos tonight, an accidental bunt base hit. And now here's Daniel Murphy. 12 to one, Expos lead with two outs and two on. On the ground, another base hit. And the bases will be loaded for Mr. Andre Dawson. Who last night hit a grand slam off the scoreboard, which turned the game around in a huge way. He's in that same situation again. Into right center, coming on is Griffey Jr. Side retired, but the damage has been done. A ton of home runs, including a ton of runs, halfway through in game five of the World Series, Expos 12, M's one. We're now gonna pause for station identification. And Elsa Cruz off for one with a ground out back in a second. He'll lead off here in this contest of the bottom of the fifth. Strasburg back to work, nursing an 11 run lead. There you see the infield. High fly ball, well in the left center. You get that one on the board for the M. So long, farewell. Boom, stick, baby, 10 run ball game. And monster shot by Nelson Cruz. It's 12 to 2 Expo. Second long home run hit by an M's player. First Cano to right field, and now Cruz to dead left center. No doubt about that one. My, oh my, what a shot. Here's Robinson Cano. And he hits this one to center field. Coming on is Griffey Jr. Onto this one, make it Adam Eaton, who makes the catch for out number one. Third baseman, number 16, Kyle Seager. Here's Kyle Seager, 0-for-1 with a strikeout in the third. A run is in, one out, nobody on base. Takes the strike, 0-1. By the way, we'll do it again. Now it's on two on Seeger. Another foul ball, we'll do it again. Foul ball, we'll do it again, foul ball. My oh my. Another foul ball, we'll do it again. 
Another foul ball will do it again. Three. Tie three, there won't be another time. Two outs in the inning. And I'll bring up Jorge Posada. Jorge 0 for 1 here in this contest. Which hitter batting left-handed here tonight takes a strike on one. Takes it down low. One ball and one strike on Jorge. Expos lead by 10. The 1-1. One, one. Hammer to right field. Here she goes. Way back. So long. Farewell. Goodbye. Nine-run lead now for the Expos. Jorge Posada with a solo bomb into the night in streets of suburbia metropolis. It's a 12 to 3 ball game. And some of this crowd trying to get into it now. After a couple of long home runs hit in this contest, especially in this inning. No doubt about that one, only how far. That is Gene Segura. He takes this one the other way to right field. Hopper's got it. Side retire, but number four, two runs, two hits. At the end of five, it's the Expos 12 and the Mariners three. Well, George Brett has had himself quite a night. Two for three with two big home runs. A two-run home run in the second. And the last inning, a big three-run home run. Mike Morin is warming in the Mariners' bullpen. As Brett skies one high in the air to center field, back is Griffey Jr. on the track, at the wall! He can't get to it, it's off the wall! And Brett will scoot in a second with a leadoff double. Wow! He just missed his third home run by a foot or so. Last night he hit one dead to center field that went over the fence barely. He almost did it again. Here's Guerrero who went has gone deep twice tonight. Line to left but foul strike one. Guerrero a good night tonight. Two for three, two home runs, two RBIs, two runs scored. Looking for his first ever world championship with his longtime club he's in the Hall of Fame in. There it goes. He's done it again. How far will this one fly? It's aiming for the scoreboard. And it's gone. So long. Farewell. His third home run in the World Series in this game. He joins Reggie Jackson and so many others who have hit three home runs in one World Series game. Vladimir Guerrero with a two-run home run makes it now a 14-3 Expo lead. History at Sportsman Park. Let's see how far this ball went. It was aiming for the scoreboard. Did it actually hit it? Let's see. Yes, it did. Holy cow. That's the second time he's done it. The Expos have done it three times. One by Dawson and now two by Guerrero. Chopper to third. Zimmerman will be out. No, he will not. That's an error. And the wheels have come off the 2018 Metropolis Mariners in the World Series. The right fielder, number 34, Bryce Harper. And now bring up Bryce Harper, who has gone deep twice in this contest. Has had a struggling World Series, but today, a little bit of a different story, hoping to continue that good ride. Popped him up, he missed it, and he knows it. First baseman is there. One down. Here's Gary Carter, one for three with a double and a run. Carter rips one deep down the left field line toward the corner. That ball will be caught. For out number two. Now 
The batter is Ozzy Smith, one for four, with a single back in the fifth. Two outs, one on, a couple of runs are in. Two out pitch to the wizard. Accidental hit, out number three. Side retired, but up before Vladimir Guerrero hits a home run. His third of this contest, middle of the six, Expo 14, M's three. Well, Ken Griffey Sr. will be the batter, one for two with a single back in the first inning. He fouls it away, strike one. Looped in the right, but that's going to be fouled near the Expos' bullpen, 0-2. And, and a fly ball, well hit in the left center field, going back is Eaton, still going back, on the track, at the wall, makes the turnaround catch for our number one. How about that play? And there's one down here in the inning. Well, he covered a lot of ground to make that catch, didn't he? Here's Edgar Martinez. Hey. Takes a strike, 0 and 1. Manners with three runs, all on solo home runs. And they were no cheapers, cheapies. They were monster shots. 0 and 2 now on Edgar. Finally, the Hall of Famer. Foul ball. And he takes it in the corner for strike three. He can't believe it. Look at his frustration. Yelling at the umpire as he leaves the field. Two outs here in the six. And the clock continues to wind down on the Mariners' chances. Here's Ken Griffey Jr. That's a ball. The 1-0, fouled away one and one. To the ship. This inning is over. No hits, no runs. We march on to the seventh of game number five of the World Series. The champagne is bubbling for the Expos. They're up 14 to three as the countdown to their first championship begins. There's your line score, 14-18-0 for the Expos, 3-5-1 for the M's. It has been all Expos. Tony Zack will now be the batter. We the pitcher for the M's. Adam Eaton, who's had a productive day at the plate and in the outfield, leads off here in the seventh. Pops it up in the infield. Kyle Seeger makes the catch. For out number one. Number 22, second base. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel Murphy will now be the batter. Two for four here tonight. Why are you holding your stomach? Oh. That's a ball. That's a ball outside, one and oh. Diaz and Morin are in the bullpen for the Mariners. Clock winding down on the Mariners' chance to try to prolong this World Series. Murphy grounds one to second. Cano's got it to Martinez, two down. He's out. The left fielder, number 10, Andre Dawson. Andre Dawson, two for four at the plate now. Nobody on base, two outs. 14 and three is the score. Takes nope. it outside, one That's and oh. Two and zero now on Dawson. Hey. And now that nipped the corner to the dismay of Andre. Two and one. 
2-1 delivery and then hit the corner to dismay of Dawson. Now the count is even at two balls and two strikes. Two outs, nobody on. The 2-2, two -two. line deep to left field. Fail or foul, it's foul. We'll do it again. Two balls and two strikes. The 2-2, two -two. ripped in the air to deep left center. That's going a long way, it is off the wall. And Dawson may be thinking about three, and nope, he's staying at second. A double for Andre Dawson, a two-out double. And the inning continues for Mr. George Brett. What a season, what a series this man has had in his first year as an expo, could be his final year in the majors as he has hinted. He's at the plate with a man in second, two outs. Has had two home runs in this contest. He fouls it away, strike one. First base coach throwing the foul ball away. No balls, one strike on Brett. Zach set at the belt. Big one. Zero. Looked like a fool on that one. That pitch was not even close to his solar system. And now it's 0-2. No balls, two strikes, one on. And two outs here in the seven. The 0-2 delivery, he got him swing inside, retired. One hit a man is stranded. We march on to the bottom of the seventh. Time to stretch in game number five of the World Series with the Expos leading 14 to three. This is, my, this is my final game. Jim Emmons, the batter, 0 for two here tonight. Flew out and grounded out. As the countdown to, the, to this final baseball game of 2018 has begun. Unless the M's have something to show for it. That's going to be a base hit right now. If you just joined us, you have missed a ton. It's 14-3. Expos lead the world, the, the uh, game five of the World Series. They lead the series three games to one. Who would have win tonight? They will capture their first ever World Championship of Baseball. Been around since 1969, but now they're a Metropolis club and have a chance to do some damage and get their first World Series in their first year coming back. Fly ball to center. Eaton's got it. He makes the catch. There's one down here in the seventh. And the Expos are 11 outs away. And now here's Robinson Cano. With a bomb to right field his last time up. Takes a strike, 0-1. 14 to three Expos lead. And what could be the final game of the 2018 baseball campaign. Foul the way, strike two. Strasburg's pitch, another foul ball. You see on your screen, there's action in the Mariner bullpen. The 0-2, popped them up, shallow right field, coming on is Hopper. Under this one, makes the catch for out number two. He'll throw to first and keep the runner right where he is. It's Kyle Seager who's had a night to forget. He's 0 for 2 here today with two strikeouts. Run at first, two outs here in the seventh inning. The pitch on the way is popped up in the air to right center. Eaton is right there. Under this one. This inning's over. The Expos are counting down to their first championship. They're nine outs away. We head out to the eighth inning. Expos 14, M's three. Well, Vladimir Guerrero has hit three home runs in one contest in a World Series game. Joined so many in baseball's history books. He grounds this one up the middle. The ship was on. Nice play by Cano, and he got him. Beautiful play by Robinson Cano to Rob Guerrero of what could have been a single, and now it's one out. Here's Ryan Zimmerman, which could be his final at bat in a Expo uniform. Ground ball, base hit in the left. And that's his swan song. That's a pretty nifty way to say goodbye. Now batting, right fielder, Brian Harper. Here's Bryce Harper. 
two home runs in this contest tonight after being pulled from cleanup position and batting in the number eight slot. That pitch was not even in his universe. He's in the 0 1 situation. Hopper in a two for four day today. Pretty good night. It was been a nightmarish World Series, but tonight you could say kind of made up for it. The 0 1 on the way. There's a pop up in the right. He knows he missed it again. That ball could be coming back. Look out. Nope. It's foul. The 0 2 to Harper. There she goes! Deep to right field! He's got himself a three home run night! So long, farewell! In what has been a series of nightmares, one night changed it all. Bryce Harper with a home run, and the Expos extend their lead big time, and now I think it's official. You can count it down to their first championship. It's 16 to 3. Two run home run. And there was no doubt about that one. Only how far. Whoa. Have a night, Bryce Hopper. Here's Gary Carter. Ball outside, 1-0. I'm almost done. The one to Carter on the ground foul. One and one. The one one delivery. Whoa, he looked like a fool on that swing. One and two. What a night for the Expos. What a season. What a postseason run for this club. As Carter strikes out, two outs. For Bryce Hopper, who's had a nightmarish World no, Series, just turned it into no, a good no, one no, with no, three no. big swings in this contest. Unbelievable. So Guerrero and Hopper both have three home runs in one game and may have a chance to do it again if they have a chance in the ninth inning. Ozzie Smith now the batter. 16-3. Expos lead. If you're a Mariner fan, you're possibly waving the white flag, but baseball's a crazy sport. High fly ball to right. Cruz is there, and he dropped the ball. That symbolizes as well as six for the Mariners. That's going to be an E9, and the inning continues. What should have been an easy out to end the inning, it turns into a bad error. And this crowd is starting to file out of this stadium for the second night in a row. Here's Adam Eaton. Takes it inside, 1-0. and oh. Daniel Murphy is on deck if this inning continues. He's eating a pretty good night tonight. Two singles and a double and an RBI. The 1-0 delivery to Eaton. He fouls it away, 1-1. One The 1-1 one, one delivery to Eaton, he's behind now, 1-2. and two. One, two delivery, down low, 2-2. Two two. The 2-2 two, two delivery, struck him out, side retired, but up before Bryce Hopper goes deep for the third time tonight. We go to the bottom of the eighth of game five of the World Series, Expo 16, Mariners three. Oh, April side of the batter, one for two with a home run to the fifth. A long home run to the fifth. To right field in the suburbia metropolis. This time he hits it the other way to left field. That could go. And it will. So long, farewell. Jorge goes back. To the deepest part of the ballpark with a home run to left center. And he's got his second home run of the contest. It's now 16 to 4.
That's the fourth home run of this game for the M's. But again, they hit the home run with nobody on base. That ball just got out of here. It was to the deepest part of the ballpark. Good pitch count for Strasburg. He could be going all the way, which would make him the third pitch, I believe, to go all the way for nine. The 0-1 to Gene. Popped him up. Foul ground. Will Carter get to this? Near the Expo dugout. He does. One away. Expos five outs away from the world title. Ken Griffey. Senior now at the plate. He grounds it to first. Zimmerman will take care of it. And the Expos are now four outs away from a title. As we go to the bottom of the eighth inning with two outs and Edgar Martinez is at the plate. The two out delivery is a strike. The pitch out again is a fly ball in the shallow left center. Eaton is under this one, backtracks again. He makes the catch. And ladies and gentlemen, the Metropolis Expos, for the first time in their franchise history, are three outs away from a title. End of eight. They lead 16 to four. Your attention, please. Edwin now, Diaz will Mariners. now be the pitcher for Number the Mariners. Out of the bullpen, his job is to end the hitting. Don't think the Expos really care if what happens in this sitting alone. Right now, what matters is the bottom of the ninth. But we start the top of the ninth, and Murphy grounds it to second. Carter, uh, Cano's got it, and there's one down. There is no action in the Expos bullpen, and rightfully so. Strasburg has been phenomenal despite surrendering four solo home runs. It's a huge lead. It's the final game, possibly, of this series and in baseball season. What more can you ask for except giving the bullpen another night off? Dawson creams one deep to right, left center field. That ball is carrying a long way. It is off the wall. And Dawson's got himself a one-out double. What a season and what a series for Andre Dawson. And George Brett, who's hit two home runs, two big ones, in this contest and one last night, steps in with one out and one on. Line to right center, will that fall in? It will. Dawson may get the call to come home. He will. It's 17 to four Expo. George Brett again delivering. And the game which already is out the reach of the M's. The, the Expos just continue to put the pedal to the metal. No fault of their own. Guerrero may have just hit number four for State Fair. Down the line. Foul. There's the stats. Three home runs, four RBIs, three runs. Scored. He's three for five today. All of its hits, all on home runs. One on, one out. There's number four deep in the left field. He has made World Series history. So long, farewell. Fourth home run of the game for Garrell. 19 to four Expos. Vladimir Garrell has just hit his fourth home run in a World Series game. History in baseball, history in suburbia metropolis, most importantly, history in the 2018 World Series. Holy cow! And that ball was destroyed. Let's see if we'll get a curtain call by some of the fans, but he didn't miss any of that. Look at that, he gets a glad air reception, from his Expos teammate, knowing this is a big moment in a championship game. Wow. 
They can't believe it. What a night for Vladimir. And now here's Zimmerman. One out, two runs have scored. Swing and a miss, strike one. Nineteen to four, Expos lead. And by the way, Bryce Hopper is lurking. Oh, two with the count. Practically anybody's in this ballpark right now. That's the way this World Series has gone for the M. As Zimmerman strikes out, two outs. So all eyes will be on this man, Bryce Hopper, who has gone deep three times. Will he join Guerrero in a four home run in a World Series game club? Takes it down low, 1 0. I fly but foul. He missed it and he knows it one and one. The well, one one delivery. Chopper to the ship. Right there is Cano. This inning's over. History has been made by Guerrero's fourth home run of the game, but most importantly, the Expos are three outs away from the championship. Last six for the M's down 19 to 4. You play 162 games a year. In one season, 162 games. You then have to go through a tough, tough playoff situation. From a wild card, possibly, to a division series, to a league championship, and then the fall classic, and you come down to this moment where you're down, where you're up by a ton and are just three outs away from your first ever world title. That's what baseball is all about, and that's where the Expos are in. That's the position they're in right now. Here we go. Strasburg against Griffey oh, Jr. There's a strike as the Expos are three outs away from capturing the franchise's very first world championship. They're three outs away from accomplishing oh. that goal, something they've waited for for almost 50 years. It's one and one on Griffey Jr. Swing and a miss, one and two. <laughs> Not much of a crowd here at Sportsman Park. There are some Expo fans here. The one, two to the kid. He hits one high in the air to right field. And that ball is gone. So long, farewell. Ken Griffey Jr. goes deep again. Throw a home run. That's the fifth home run hit by the Mariners in this contest. It's 19 to 5. Well. Ken Griffey. Another long home run in late innings. Again, doesn't make a dent in the scoreboard like it should, meaning it's kind of like a meaningless home run. Nevertheless, it's a home run for Griffey. It's 19 to five, and Jim Edmonds will now be the batter. He's one for three with a single back in the seventh. 19 to five, Expos lead three outs away from a world championship. There's a ground ball toward the hole. Oh, mercy! What a play by Murphy! He got him! One down, and the Expos are two outs away. That's going to be on the highlight wheel. Holy cow, what a play by Daniel Murphy. And here's Nelson Cruz. One out delivery by Strasburg. Found away. Strike one.
The 0-1 delivery, swing and a miss. 0-2. 0-2 delivery, just missed the corner. Strasburg will try to make another complete game performance. It'll be the third one straight for the Expos pitching staff, giving the bullpen a well-deserved rest. The one-two to Cruz, right up the middle, base hit in the right center. That could be problems, and it could be extra bases for Cruz. He's on his way to second. And now he's digging about three. The ball will be cut off. Here comes the throw. It's a triple for Cruz. Robinson Cano will now be the batter. Well, nobody's second. The final two outs of this contest will be easy. Although they're down by a ton in the end, I'm not making it easy. The batter now is Robbie Cano. Fouls it away, strike one. Now, Strasburg is approaching 80 pitches. Cano one for three with a solo home run back in the third. M's down to their final two outs. Swing and a miss, so and two. The 0-2 delivery popped up in the center. Let's see if they'll score that runner. Adam with a great arm, makes the catch, tag against Cruz. Here comes a long throw home, not in time. A run to score. But the Expos are, are just one out away from winning the World Series. They're becoming champions of baseball. It all comes down to this. Kyle Seeger at the plate for the Mariners against Steven Strasburg on the mound. Here we go. Foul away, strike one. The 0-1. Strike two, and the M's are down to their final out. <clears throat> Base is empty. Two outs, ninth inning. Strasburg at 83 pitches. This will be pitch number 84. Expos 19. Mariners 6. Expos lead the series three games to one. One strike away from a title. The 0-2. Fly ball deep in the right center field. Ian is going to give it a look. It is gone. Kyle Seager prolongs the celebration with a solo home run. It's 19 to 7. Expos lead. You wonder if Strasburg is running out of gas. Crucial moment, one out to go from capturing the championship. And Seeger prolongs the agony. So here we go again. Jorge Posada, the final hope for the M. The Expos one out away for the championship. Foul away, strike one. The 0-1, ground ball, base here in the left. The inning continues. I'll bring up Gene Segura. Again, the Expos down to their, have, are just one out away from a title, but the M's keep fighting. Two out delivery. Swing and a miss, strike one. <clears throat> the 0 1. Fouled away, and the M's are down to their final strike. So here's the setup. 
Posada at first, two outs, 19 to seven, Expos lead a strike away from a title. Here it is, got him! It's over! 53 years in the making, it's finally happened! The Metropolis Expos are world champions of baseball! Holy cow! A season filled with unbelievable moments. This is the finest one in baseball history. They have lost their minds on the field. It has finally happened. Over five decades of waiting, praying, and hoping the Metropolis Expos are world champions. They take down the Mariners four games to one in the World Series. Holy cow. As we wrap up this season, the final moments we see of the Expos celebrating their first title. Wow. What more can you say? 19 to 7 is the final as the Expos take game five of the World Series. We'll see you in spring training, everybody. The Expos are 2018 World Champions.